A disturbing story. The Gatineau Mosque is once again the target of vandals. It's the second time in three days, and the message is getting more hateful. Sandra Abma joins us live with the details. Sandra. Adrian, this is the fourth such incident at the Gatineau Mosque in six months. But this one is more graphic and uglier. This time, the building has been covered with graffiti, defacing the entrances and windows of this house of worship, spray-painted with offensive slogans and religious symbols. The Canadian Council on American-Islamic Relations is calling on the police to investigate the incident as a hate crime. It bears all of the hallmarks of, of a hate crime. I mean, you, you can see there's obviously very clear anti-Arab, anti-Muslim uh, language that's used in addition to obscene language as well um, that, uh, you know, singles out a particular minority group. Just last Monday, the mosque was vandalized. Windows were damaged and someone attempted to set fire to two cars in the parking lot. The Secretary General of the Gatineau Mosque wants all government officials to stand up and condemn the acts and the police to take the matter very seriously. We wanted the police authority to take all the means to arrest this person as fast as possible. And we also ask our community to stay calm and serene and uh, in front of this provocation. The mosque's surveillance cameras recorded the person who did this. The video has been forwarded to the Gatineau police. I don't want to make the, the, the people scared about what happened, so f uh, just want to let them know that we, we will be around. We are going to make some more patrol around the, uh, the mosque, uh, and then there, there will be some surveillance by the police officer. And Adrian, police go on to say that they have reviewed the surveillance videos and they have reason to believe that the same person is responsible for both acts of vandalism that occurred at the mosque this week. Adrian. Okay, thanks, Sandra. Very troubling story. That's the CBC's Sandra Abma.